Alright guys, welcome back to Portal 2. Uh, last episode, we've learned that Wheatley has gone rather insane. And is probably going to try Only to kill more us. chambers to your big surprise! <laughs> oh, that's tired. Are you still here? <laughs> Alright. Whoa, whoa, my bad. Let's see, what does this do? Oh, it reverses it. Gotcha. Huh. I need a cube. Where's my cube at? Where's my cube? Yeah. Alright, we'll just go over there the old fashioned way. Oh, see. Yeah. Yeah, we'll bring the gelatin over there. I didn't get it all the way over. Whoops. Huh. Should probably do that again. I can't really see like how much I covered. I don't really know what the purpose of it is, but you know. It's whatever. There we go. I got a lot more of it that time. Okay, so now we'll go. Oh god, how do I get back over there? Oh, I need to drop a little right here. There we go. So that I can jump into it. Yep. Oh, it's all graded. Oh. Oh. I didn't put any on it. It's all graded. So then where do I take the gelatin to? What does the button do? It opens this. What does that do though? Let's see. Hmm. They shoot me rather quickly. Is that right above them? I can't really tell. I kind of want to see if I could put the gelatin through them. But how would I do that? Because to get the gelatin all the way over there to make them bounce, I'd have to escort it like that. And then what? It would be right here floating. Like that? No. I'd have to like Huh. I'd have to have some kind of like I'd have to have a way for me to get it through a portal. Oh I could just throw it like that. Whoops. So have it come over here in the air but whenever it drops how am I going to change how it drops it's always going to drop right in this area because that's where it comes out of so it stays in a straight line through here <coughs> sorry about that guys so it stays in a straight line so it would come through this way. Gelatin in here. 
and then what could I do with it? Uh, dang. This one's got me at a uh, standstill. What does the reverse do, though? Oh! Oh, I wonder. Let's try that. So we're gonna go. We're gonna go over there. Put that up. Click this button. Have it all drop. Get it all the way over there so it has a good amount of time. Oh, I should have gone earlier. It's gonna all splatter. Yeah, it all splattered. I should have gone earlier. Alright, so now that, and that, and that, and jump. Hey guys. Alright, so now we reverse it. Okay, now how do I, once it gets through that, I put it back through. So now go back through and then here. Yeah! Alright. And then we drop it. Yes! Oh yeah! That was awesome. What did that do? Oh, it does that. Alright, so then how do I launch myself that kind of distance? Because that is a hell of a distance. Oh, I think I'm going to bounce on that. Hmm. We'll see. We will see. So now just how do I launch myself that distance? I need a lot of height. Nothing to fall on. Anything to fall on over here? No? No? I don't think so. How would I launch myself? Definitely won't be high enough. Yeah, uh, we'll try it. I don't know anything else to do. Yeah, that's definitely not going to be high enough. Oh, you saw oh. that? Good, good one. Good for you. So he's inexplicably happy all of a sudden, even though he should be going out of his mind with test withdrawal. And he's got a surprise for us. What did he find back there? Hmm. Maybe it's the cake. Maybe he found my cake. Because that would be awesome. Found my cake. I'll bet you're both dying to know what your big surprise is. Well, only two more chambers. Alright. My silent protagonist will just play along. Surprise! We're doing it now. Okay. Credit where it's due. For a little idiot built specifically to come up with stupid and workable plans. That was a pretty well laid trap. You probably <laughs> figured it out by now, but I don't need you anymore. I found two little robots back here built specifically for testing. Oh. He found the cooperative testing initiative. Anything personal, just, you know, you did kill me. There's 
Matt. This is the part where I kill you. Had a bit of a brainwave. There I was, smashing some steel plates together. And I thought to myself, yeah, it's deadly. But what's missing? What's missing? And I thought, lots of sharp bits welded onto the... F no, 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 no. Don't do that. Don't. Stand right here. Stand. Where'd you go? Come back, come back. Dang. That would have been a hell of a crush. No, seriously, do come back. Please, come back, please. Okay, look, I've decided I'm not gonna kill you, okay, if you come back. Oh, okay, well in that case, no! Oh, just thinking back to the old times, the old days when we were friends, good old friends, not enemies. And I would say something like, come back, and he'd be like, yeah, no problem, and he'd come back. What happened to those days? What happened to those days? Uh, what do I do here? That's a portal. I guess I gotta launch myself to to that platform, maybe. We'll see. I can't help but notice that you're not coming back, which is disappointing. Oh, I've got an idea. Hey, buddy. Yes, yes, in your face, I got armor. Fine. Let the games begin. Ah. Poor little guy. Yo, how do I get in there? Oh. Oh yeah. Wow, so we stopped the last episode at a really good time for like this to all start in this episode. That's pretty awesome. It's good how that worked out. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm almost there. Ah. Don't mind me. Continue escaping. How do I get in there? Oh. Ha! Death trap. Oh crap. Are they killing you? They are killing you, aren't they? Silently killing you. Um, probably. If I had to guess. They're mal um, oh they malfunctioned. Perhaps the turrets have found a way to use Garotts. That would explain the, the extremely quiet killing that I'm hearing. Garotts? What are garotts? If you're dying, but not dead, stop one. Ha! Ah, was that your bullet? Riddle bullet flying out of the room? It was... Oh, those were the crap turrets, weren't they? Yeah. Well, no matter, because I'm still holding all the cards. And guess what? They're all full houses. Never actually <laughs> play cards, meaning to learn. Anyway, new turret, not defected. Ace of fours, best hand. Unbeatable, I would imagine. <laughs> that was fun. Bye, guys. Oh, am I supposed to go this way? Am I supposed to go through there? I think I am. That doesn't make any sense. Why would I want to go through there? Whatever. Oh, I see. Clever. Very clever. And foolish. Spinny blade wall. Machiavelli. Oh. Uh huh. Well, good, good. Finally, a nemesis worthy of my vast intellect. A nemesis worthy of my vast intellect. Holmes versus Moriarty. Aristotle versus Mashi Spike Plate. Um. Yeah, I was like, I should have dropped down. I saw that. I, I saw a little white in the background. I saw the, the timing. Of my vast but I did not react fast enough. I was I guess I was more James shocked. I was just like Moriarty. I wonder if it won't hit me. Aristotle versus Mashi Spike Plate. 
Oh no. Still, please. All right, stop moving. Oh, almost got you there, almost got you there. Where do oh. we go? It's getting crazy. Where do you go? Come back, come back. Getting epic. Alright, thank Something you. Something great back there. Oh, oh, did it kill you? That would be amazing if it killed you. Hello? Holy oh, oh, crap. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, alright, no, just had a brainwave. I'll be back. If you're still alive, I'm gonna be back. Don't die until I get back. What the devil am I supposed to use here? Bruh. Oh. What does this do? Okay. Let's just throw it at them. This is actually kind of hilarious. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's kind of awesome. I genuinely enjoyed that. That was, that was fun. This is getting crazy. Crazy. Whew. Crashing's too good for him. First, he'll spend a year in the incinerator. Year two, cryogenic refrigeration wing. Then, ten years in the chamber I where all the robots scream at you. Then I'll kill him. <laughs> Gladys on that on that level right now. Oh. I probably don't want that over here in my life. Where do I put it then? Oh, there we go. To make it uh, explode that. Okay, so now that it exploded it, what do I do with this now? Oh. Oh. Uh, duh. Whoa. Come on, get through that. There you go. Aperture, caperture. A lot of gel. I just realized that Gladys said she had a room where robots scream at you. That's actually hilarious. Just there, 
uh, less a death trap, more a death option for you. Sounds crazy, I know, but hear me out, hear me out. Once you get to my lair, death will not be optional, all right? It will be mandatory. No tricks, no surprises, just you dying as a result of me killing you in a very, very gruesome way. So, but, okay, I'll take that as a no then. Fine, well, may the best man win. Sphere, may the best sphere win. Swap that, swap that in, much more clear. But. <laughs> That's where I came in. Where's the exit? Obviously, I have to run into that portal. But then, what? Do I run to here? Is that what I do? Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. Alright, here we go. Ah, yeah! That was dope. See, those kind of puzzles I could do. I could figure that kind of stuff out. How big is this place? God. Oh. Oh, I still have my running stuff on it. Okay. I'm trying to look to see if there's anything I need to run into. Whoa. Okay, let's not do that again. How do I jump up there? How do I get up there? Hmm, interesting. Yeah, I think I figured it out. Wee oh yeah. Yeah, that worked. It made sense. This place is huge, like what is this this facility is like the size of a city. I think I'm going to actually end it here and get the ending of this game in its own episode. So, I'll see you guys in the next one. Take it easy.